I have beta 4 for DaVinci Resolve 20 installed. But when I opened up Resolve today, I had this pop up showing me that an update is available, uh, beta 4 for DaVinci Resolve Studio 20. By the way, if you don't see these pop ups for these beta updates, uh, a link in the description to a video where I talk about um, where in the settings to get those, um, not just like the major updates, but even these beta ones. But <laughs> To explain this, I have a video going over beta four, some of the new things there, but uh, in the comments and on Twitter and everywhere else, I've seen tons of people talk about specific audio issues in beta four. And that's what this beta four is meant to fix, or at least start to help resolve. This is the first time I've seen Blackmagic Design do it this way, but if you head over to the uh, forum, they have a general post for beta four with what was new in that update. But then underneath that, uh, we see this post from Anish that says, we have a minor update to DaVinci Resolve 20 at public beta four. Uh, available on our support website. This update addresses the audio dropouts that some Windows users faced. And so he says to please re-download the public beta for build. So this is still called beta four, it's still under that name. On the support page is actually pretty interesting because this uh, public beta four um, has sort of like a republish today. So they address this one fix, but they're keeping everything else the same. So if you wanted to jump to beta four, maybe to see uh, those new easing controls or try out um, some of the new things in the uh, subtitle options. By the way, I tried to clarify, um, I was wrong in my last video, the ability to drop fusion clips onto uh, subtitle tracks, even if you generated those subtitles or type them in yourself, that is still a studio feature. That's a bummer. But Resolve quickly pushing an update to address uh, these audio issues, that's really nice. Plenty of people are still watching the video I put out just two days ago about beta four. So I figured it was worth another small update of my own to maybe let some of those people know what's going on. If you hadn't updated to beta four and you just grabbed this update, you should be in a better spot. But if you um, either are currently running that beta four and running into audio issues, or you jumped on four, then scaled back to beta three, um, but want to come back to four to see if things are fixed, now you've got options. That's all, quick video. Don't forget, I have dozens of free uh, presets and templates and titles for DaVinci Resolve over at strongsupply.co, as well as some paid products like my uh, recent pack of YouTube subscribe button pop-ups or my uh, glitch and uh, screen pump effect that I put out recently. If you haven't checked those out, absolutely do. I think they're pretty cool. Hopefully you do too. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.